So I want to get into printmaking. More specifically, I want to get into copper printmaking. <laughs> I would love to make the pizza dough uh, press thing. It looks a bit too complicated for my abilities. So I'm gonna go for the more uh, torture device looking press. So that is going to be our bridge, which is going to push them out a little bit. Good. Okay, looks pretty good. Nice. And kind of nice. Yeah, baby. Loop, <laughs> sloop. There we go. Looking good. Houston, we have a problem. From all places, the wood can chatter or bl or uh, how is it called? Blow out. He decided to do it here. Why?
Come on. You can do it. Okay. So now I want to make two balls. Yeah, two balls. Uh, they're gonna be kind of like counterweights on the handle. I've been thinking like this is cherry, we have oak, we have like a mix and match. Also different type of oak or ash or something, Douglas. So yeah, it's very much a whole party of woods. So I thought maybe I'm gonna stain it or something like that to make it all even looking and, and nice and dandy. But uh, I think I'm just gonna burn it all. Okay, I am going to stain it, but don't worry, it will look delicious, it will look great. So, we're gonna put some shellac. So, while all of this dries, uh, we're going to engrave some how the label pin, I think. And I've designed one especially for that. I wish it was a little bit clearer than this. Okay, I think I put something backwards because it didn't align right or maybe I didn't do the measurements correctly or something. But I gave it a bit more 
uh, leeway so it can move just a bit. I don't think it's gonna be a problem because it's gonna be centered by the bottom plate. So let's see. So you see, it's not exactly aligned, it's close. I think we have it. I want to get a feel of how strong this is really. And the way to check it is Yeah, I'd say that's pretty strong. So I've prepared a tiny kind of a lino cut. In the future, I want to do something a little bit more precise than, than lino cut, which is gonna be wood engraving or, or, I don't know, copper engraving, which I don't know if this machine can handle. And I have some paper that need to be wettened or moistened, I should say, but we're gonna try without it first. All right, don't touch anything. Right. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> yes, yes, it works. Yeah, it actually works really well. Not as much pressure this time. Okay, so I. This is quite complicated. <laughs> so uh, I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did. Uh, this is an absolutely incredible addition to the to the shop. I think. So yeah, hopefully already in the next video we can do some engraving and printmaking and all this uh, fun stuff. So thanks for watching and I will uh, catch you up in the next video.